dozens of misconduct complaints against Illinois lawmakers will now be investigated. Just a few hours ago, a new legislative inspector general was appointed. CBS 2's Audrina Vigas is here to tell us more about this appointment and what it means. Good evening, Jim and Mai. The new special legislative inspector general is just temporary. Her name is Julie Porter. She is a former assistant U.S. attorney in Chicago and serves, served as chief of the criminal division. She's a special inspector general in order to deal with the backlog, the emergency situation that we have found. Illinois State Senator Karen McConaughey is referring to the 27 ethic complaints against lawmakers that have slid under the radar with no acting inspector general in the past three years. It's absolutely outrageous and it's incumbent on us to ensure that that never happens again. Tonight, McConaughey and other members of the Legislative Ethics Commission voted unanimously on the appointment of Julie Porter. She's going to address those 27 complaints and see if some of them are frivolous, if some of them deserve to be investigated, or what nature they are. I did file a complaint. Denise Rothheimer publicly accused Senator Ira Silverstein of sexual harassment and said she filed a complaint one year ago with still no response. This is when McConaughey learned that there were any complaints at all. The Illinois General Assembly is still incapable of policing itself. We still need to change how we do these kinds of investigative matters. With Rothheimer's admission and more harassment headlines coming out of Springfield, there was a new urgency to hire an inspector general, as there is a statute of limitations on when an investigation can be conducted into complaints about lawmakers' behavior. We don't know the nature of the other 26 outstanding complaints. That's because names of the accusers, the accused, and the alleged violations are all kept private. Jim and Mai. All right. Thank you, Aldrina.